Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and click the bell icon to get notified whenever I upload new content. Today, we have an exciting DIY project that's perfect for all tech enthusiasts and anyone looking to keep their smartphone cool during intense usage. We're going to build a DIY water cooling system for your phone using simple, affordable materials you can find around the house. Let's dive right in. Project Overview In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how to create an effective water cooling system for your smartphone. We'll be using a plastic water jug, a small water pump, some plastic tubing, and a custom-made copper cooling block. This setup is perfect for preventing your phone from overheating, especially during gaming sessions or extensive use. Materials needed. Before we start, let's go over the materials you'll need. 1. A plastic water jug with a lid. 2. A small water pump. You can find these online or at local hardware stores. 3. Clear plastic tubing. Make sure it fits snugly with your pump and cooling block. 4. A copper cooling block. You can either purchase one or make it yourself if you have the tools. 5. Zip ties or clamps to secure the tubing. 6. A power source for the pump. 7. Distilled water. It's better than tap water as it reduces the risk of mineral buildup. 1. Preparing the jug. First, take your plastic water jug and clean it thoroughly. This will be our water reservoir. Drill two small holes in the lid of the jug, just big enough to fit your plastic tubing through. 2. Setting up the tubing. Cut two pieces of plastic tubing. One will be for the water going into the cooling block and the other for the water returning to the jug. Insert one end of the first tube into the water pump outlet and secure it with a clamp or zip tie. Insert the other end of this tube through one of the holes in the jug lid. 3. Connecting the cooling block. Attach the free end of the first tube to the copper cooling block. Secure it tightly to avoid any leaks. Take the second piece of tubing and attach one end to the cooling block's outlet. Feed the other end of this tube through the second hole in the jug lid, ensuring it goes into the jug. 4. Installing the pump. Place the water pump inside the jug, making sure it's submerged in water. Fill the jug with distilled water, leaving some space at the top. Secure the lid tightly on the jug. 5. Powering the system. Connect the water pump to its power source. Ensure all connections are secure and there are no leaks. Power on the pump and check the flow of water through the tubing and cooling block. 6. Attaching to the phone. Now, carefully attach the cooling block to the back of your smartphone. You can use adhesive thermal pads or another method that ensures good contact without damaging your phone. Once everything is set up, test the system by using your phone for a while and monitoring the temperature. 